Ellen is here. Right. We've got to go get to Anna Angel. Uh, and go to Andre Stamatin. And then we should probably go to our factory and try to uh, brew some stuff. Oh, there's some herbs out here somewhere. I vaguely remember a child taking me out into the steppe find some herbs. Uh, right. Let's, uh... Oh, our immunity's not too bad. Exhaustion's not too bad. Hunger's not too bad. Thirst isn't too bad. Things are looking up for us. Right. Out we get. And let's just prepare ourselves for the outside for a second. Whew. Right, so I want to leave here, go left. Yeah, I'll take that. Right, I don't want to encounter any more plague if possible. <laughs> I am finding this quite scary, I'm not going to lie. Is this where I'm supposed to be going? Uh, I think this is the way I'm supposed to be going. Yep. Nope, wrong way. Yep. So, isn't this our father's house? Is Can we do anything with that? Okay, it's still locked. But it's nice that I remember something. I am quite scared running around here. My immunity is getting quite low. Oh, if I'm going in the right direction. It's, I think this is the house I want to be at. Is this it? It's around here. Wait. My immunity isn't looking too good. <laughs> Where are the immunity boosters? That did not help as much as I thought they would. Oh. I was hoping for something more useful. I'm I'm not going to lie. Um I'll use this, I guess. Oh, I'll wait till my immunity is a little bit lower first. So, I want to get into this house. How the hell do I get in? Please let me in, my immunity is getting low. Ah, uh, I guess I should have gone around the other side. I can hear the noise of plants that I can harvest. That immunity is getting quite low again. Oh, okay, the door was just here. I just couldn't see it because it was too dark. Mm. <laughs> I wasted immunity for nothing. <laughs> Let me in. Let me into the safety. 
Right, let's take some immunity boosters because I'm having a bad time. <laughs> oh no, is this my last one? Hmm, I'm gonna have to get the hell out of here soon. Hold on. There's just plague there. Oh, what? It, it's coming through. Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. Oh, fuck off! Fuck off! How, how, how do I know which one's Anna's? Am I even in the right house? No, I'm not! I want to get the hell out of here! No, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone! I want to leave, I want to leave, I want to leave! Uh, <laughs> I'm finding this very scary. <laughs> If this girl wants something that will protect her from the plague, she's shit out of luck, so I don't even have anything to protect me from the plague. <laughs> Is there, uh, anything going on in here? Nope. I, I really regret going into that other plaguey house. I, I made a bad mistake there. The day is over. Today was a turning point. Fates are decided at midnight. If you want to protect someone, take care of them before nightfall. A new pantomime is being rehearsed in the theatre. Infected over the past 24 hours, 343 people. Gone missing, 36 people. Okay, I missed it all. Great. Is this Anna's house? What? Who the fuck are you? Yes? Oh no! Hmm? Okay. Wait, do I have to keep all of these people alive? Hmm. Hmm. Ah. Excellent. You had 12 days. Not so many, but enough. One more day has passed. The town shifts. Something stirs in the theater. Some Where the hell is Anna Angel if not here? Uh, and, and there's just like this woman who I think is infected there. I can't talk to her. I'm scared to get past her. Something stirs within you. Oh, I'm supposed to give them medicine. Dude, I do not know what you need. I can't diagnose you. I, I don't have the things here, I'm sorry. Okay, so I, I came here for absolutely nothing. I, I ran through a plague house for absolutely nothing. So, I, I can set a little marker on the map. I'm setting it to here. And then hopefully I can just leave this place, we'll run, we'll get out of the plague district, we'll go see the theatre, we'll, we'll brew some medicine, it's gonna be okay. <laughs> I say with all the confidence in my heart. Cool.
Let me out, let me out, let me out. Oh, no. There's pyres on this side of town. That's not good. Um, I, I don't... Why are you setting up huge fires everywhere? Why is there still a guard here? If this is an infected district? Wait, did, did I bring the infection? Am I a plague rat? So... What's the quickest way through here? I want to go straight down here and then up. Right, let's try and run. What the hell did I lose there? Oh, did they just run out of usefulness or something? I, I don't know. Let, let me out of the plague district. Let me out of the plague district. Let me out of the plague district. Ah, oh, there's some fires over there too. Ah, oh, the the plague is really becoming a problem, lads. Oh no, it doesn't seem... So, is Dark Grey infected? This is in recent infection. I don't... I, I really do not know. Either way, we'll come through here. We'll, we'll go see the theatre. See how bad we're fucked, and then we'll go see why the air feels solid around this house. I guess. Huh. I don't think I need these things. Please have somebody thrown away some immunity boosters, because that, that's something I, I need. <laughs> I will take all the empty bottles that you will allow me to have, though. I feel like I need a thimble for something. So will will this make these more durable? I I don't really know. How durable are they at the moment? They're doing all right. The, the cloth mask needs repairing. Oh, I need a safety pin. That's the bugger. Am I heading in the right way for the pantomime? Yes, yes I am. Like I, I, I already knew the plague was scary. Don't don't get me wrong about that. But it's scarier than, <laughs> than I thought it was. Oh, do I need to go around the other side and enter the pharmacy from not the pharmacy, the theatre from the top? That is the sound of plants that grow. I pour blood for? I don't really understand. Hmm. 
because it doesn't seem to allow me to harvest it. Oh wait. Thank you. Ah, oh, trust you don't trade. Fine, fuck you. Well, that was very annoying. <laughs> but uh, I should have expected that and worse from this game, to be honest. Ah, oh, it's going to make me come out the way I came in, isn't it? I don't like this dude who's just staring at the plants. This music is very unsettling. Oh, hold on. The plants that you can harvest give off a little like light above them I feel like that's going to be easier to find them at night I'm going to have to go wandering around the step looking for stuff now so this the theatre but again I imagine it won't let me through this door yeah alright come on ask me let's hustle I know there's no plague here, but let, let, let's hustle, my dude. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the outbreak. The theater is officially disbanded. As well as other conveniences, running water, access to your own children, who never leave their beloved polyhedron anyway, sewage, friendly smiles on the street, any respect for the institution of marriage, food, etc., etc. On the order of that big city bachelor, all theatrical costumes are to be handed out to orderlies. You know, protection. By the way, obeying the orderlies is now mandatory, per current laws. Is that all? For now. The town is doomed. Why bother with any of this? Oh, ladies and gentlemen, please focus on your life aspirations. You have little more than a week now. Make sure your affairs are in order, and do your best to pursue your dismal dreams. Wanting, but okay. So, I guess we should, uh, go see why the air feels solid around this house. Oh yeah, I was supposed to go here. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry gang, I've made you all wait for me. I, I will be there. Just just give me a little while to get there. Ooh, beautiful stuff. Hell yeah, I'll take a grindstone. That feels like it's going to be useful at some point. Oh, so does my immunity slowly go up when I'm not in plague areas? Because that's, that's very ideal for me. So it doesn't really matter how I get around this house. I can then uh, go down afterwards. Where's the walkway? There it is. This is struggling. <laughs> Come on.
Please don't try and fight me. Please don't try and fight me. We're still going in the right direction. Sort of. Oh yeah, no I am. There's some running going on over there. And I feel like I don't want to be beaten to death. So I'm just going to run with my arms out. Just in case. Don't really want any part of that though. Okay, weirdo kids. Okay, I don't think I uh, need my fisticuffs. So if I run straight down here... I should eventually bump into the gang. Oh, yep, yeah, I see him. I see him. Gang, I'm coming. I reunited the gang. Oh, my ha hunger's not doing too good. I'll uh, eat an egg. That helps somewhat. Okay, hazelnuts also said the kids here would sell their souls for a handful. Hopefully they're worth more than the other things. Oh, and I can see some plants that I can go harvest. I'm harvesting that first. Thank you. The wench has us all over a barrel. Nothing to be done about it now. A murder of crows, huh? There weren't so many crows in town before, were there? Listen, you want to talk about the Merry Knife Men, the Night Hunters. Uh, I don't know, let's talk about the crows. Nope, it was all sparrows before, and larks, and a fair share of starlings. So where did they all go to? Scared, aren't you, brother? Huh? What will you do with all the cutthroats? What can I even do? Pretend I'm still their leader to their face. Then disown him around polite society. Already on it. What else is there? It's up to you, pal, but it won't last long. Not this way. Thanks for sharing your opinion. Now shove it up your ass. Thanks, bad grief. <laughs> Calm down. It's too late for me. I've only got one road ahead of me now. Perhaps the outbreak is for the best. Plagues like fires. People forget old scores. And all hell will break loose here soon. Any dark prophecies to share? You're the criminal mastermind here after all. So the outbreak makes you happy, huh? Um, <laughs> no need to prophesize. People fear hunger. Even honest workers will turn their hatchets and hammers to crime. Burgling houses, looting corpses, gutting each other. They will. Oh, they will. <coughs> Not all of them grief, not all. The turf's so dry, you won't even need a match. A glare would start a fire. And when the kin bears its teeth, that's when we'll all dance. They're slow on the start, but oh so fast on the draw. The master likes a mute and obedient, but apathy makes them that way, not stupidity. They're only obedient till the time comes. And here it comes. Yeah, big words. Filled with bad grief. And the people who lose their jobs? They won't be too fond of staying home. They'll find new hobbies, like looking for food or venting their anger. And Fat Vlad shut his facilities down the day before yesterday, didn't he? Crafty. Didn't whisper so much as a single word to me. Do you think he knew? I think he might have suspected. Perhaps that's why he locked up Paternitary, to protect the workers. If it's the same sand pest we saw five years ago, we're all finished. There was no salvation for it. Every single person in the crew sprawl died. Your father was fast enough to lock the doors back then, so it died there. Only reason we're still alive. Now we can't even lock the gate. 
And there's no one to lock it either. Yeah, he, he made a hard choice. Perhaps if he had more time, he could find a better solution. Alright. Yes. Why is this dude always so angry at me? My father was my father, not your father. L l let it go. Yeah, I didn't expect you to come. Neither did I, but I don't regret it. I've regained my strength a bit. This place is good. I've already forgotten what the step is like. What's that train car over there? I don't remember it before. Damned if I know. I think someone lives there. A kid, maybe. I saw a ball there in the rails. Kids often gather around these parts. Not everyone is fo fond of that polyhedron. Not everyone fits there. Not everyone fits. I don't know. I've no idea how to deal with children. Never had. Oh, you and me both, Reuben. <laughs> even, when you were one, even when you were one yourself. Enough idle chatter. Yes, I am angry with you, and you ought to understand why I... St why? It, I mean, this is right. It's not anger, pal. It's jealousy. Let go of it. It's ridiculous. But I don't want to end the conversation like that. <laughs> that. You said the kin were after you. Do they have a good reason? Your kind doesn't take kindly to cutting bodies, and cutting bodies is my job. My mentor. I mean your father. You know you know what he meant for the kin. He did have that right, kind of, but still. I was the one they demonized. And that's fine. I don't mind. Yeah, but... Why did our father allow it? I don't... He wasn't part of the kin. He didn't have that. And our father was so respected. Why was he running around doing things like this? And who would hurt your kind otherwise? Fat Vlad, your elders? He had a hard job. And he did operate when he absolutely had to. But bodies require autopsy. You know it as well as I. I still don't know what that... Patho... Anatomy thing is. <laughs> I, I'm not. I'm not very smart. I'm not smart enough for this game. But I'm. I'm gonna get through it. I'm, I'm gonna work through it. Yeah, you truly were a loyal apprentice to him. Right. What's Lara got to say? My heart beats uneven. Hmm. Should probably see uh, that big city doctor. We've been talking while we're waiting for you. Yeah, what did you talk about? Isn't it obvious? Any old grudges pale in comparison to this sort of catastrophe. Uh, tragedies like this bring people together. Ought to anyway. I feel like this plague will become a great weaver. Mending that which was broken. I mean, go for tragedies. I disagree. The outbreak will sow discord. It will tear apart friends, families. It wasn't the plague that got us together. It was you. Yeah, if not for the plague, no one would change their mind. No, it was all you, your will. You've done things really well. You swallowed your pride and the wrongs done to you. You weren't ashamed to vouch for grief. I don't think I could have done the same. The last hug before the flood comes. We'll protect each other and we'll try to survive, yes. We'll try. By the way, do you know why all the stations were shut down? The passenger station was shut down a year ago. Cargo only, recently. In the summer, there was some sort of renewal project. Remember how enthusiastic they were about building new railroads before the war? So were you also there on the front? Uh. Well, I, I don't know if one's a lie. <laughs> I'll go for this. Served as a medic. It makes me sound a bit better. What do you know of this disease? They're calling it sand pest. You know why? Yeah, why sand? Because it makes your skin dry like sand. People still believe it came from below the ground. All those fairy tales of an earthen golem. 
a clay leg shabnak. Oh, not the shabnak again. I thought we'd move past the shabnak. It mowed down everyone in that poor district last time. No survivors. Every single person got infected. Every single person died. Does that mean there's no hope? The important things inside us need not rely on hope. I hope you don't mean the internal organs. It's good that you still have the sense of humour. So. Yeah, I need to go get some medicine to her. I really should be checking why the air feels solid around that house too. Hmm. Yeah, do you know what? We'll take a quick trip up. But I'm also going to look to see if there's... Oh yes, there's some more things I can harvest over here. I'll have you. I'll have you. I'll have you. So they all make different noises. That's fun. Yeah, this is the way I wanted it to go, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Let's go see why the air feels solid around that house, and uh, then we'll go see how many tinctures we can brew up. Because <laughs> Lord knows we're, we're going to need them soon. Oh, yep. I remember that. Actually, what can I trade with it? Uh, you don't have anything of value. So, do I find out about the house by going inside of it or checking for something on the outside? Or can I loot from this? I'll uh, take a chestnut. Ah, oh, come on. This is taking you a long time. Oh yeah, I'll have your money. I don't know if that's useful, but I'll have it anyway. Okay, yeah, this definitely requires me to go inside, and I'm really scared I'm going to encounter a plague cloud in here. Please don't be a plague cloud. Please, God, if you love me, <laughs> don't give me a plague cloud. Okay. Talk to you two. Also, see what else is going on. This is weird to have this little up section. Oh, it's Capella. You've interrupted a difficult conversation. I think you should leave. The blood of the town is not a figment of our imagination, nor does it involve step rights. People are the blood of the town. Hmm. Yeah, perhaps I can help. It's our business. I'd like to know more. I understand there are things you want to know. You think we might tell you if you ask right, but we won't. Not now. You two are serious girls. Did you see anything strange on your way here? Well, a play cloud flew at me earlier. Out now. Why do you want to keep kicking me out of places? What are you doing here? Dividing power, you're not required. Who knows? 
One more word from you and everything will break. I told you to get lost. Are you stupid? No, I hear you loud and clear. It's still just telling me the air feels solid around this house. I, I want to know why. Like, what's going on in here? Oh, hello. Words are neither priceless nor worthless. They are only their purpose. So why did you interrupt our argument? What argument? There used to be two mistresses, right? Nina and Victoria. One burned, the other soothed. Nina died, so Katrina replaced her. Then Victoria died and Katrina was torn apart. Now there are no more mistresses. The town is unprotected. Do you follow? Not really. QED. Oh, the hell does that mean? But it's none of your concern, Barack. So you bumped uh, into us accidentally, whatever. But why couldn't you keep your big mouth shut? Don't you understand that words have power? You utter a word because you're bored and the whole future changes. It changes constantly. Listen carefully, Barack. Look at me. I will make it so that you can only talk to people when it doesn't interfere with my plans. This is your first warning. If you get in my way again, I'll take your speech away completely. I don't think you have that power. You need me to explain it like you're two. You approach someone I have a plan for, you try to talk to them and nothing happens. Your mouth went open. Clear now? How will I know who you have plans for? By trying and failing to talk to them. Fair enough. Also, you don't believe me? Be my guest. Go back and try to talk to the girls. I do believe you. Take pity on my poor soul. So, using the rail lines, I think we can get to, oh, I can't use that rail line, we can get to where we can brew some stuff. I think that's what we should be doing. So, I want to go this way, and we'll just run for as long as we can. Oh, well, it's nice that I finally figured out how to see which plants I can harvest and which ones I can't. I still don't understand why some of them I've got to pour blood on the ground. Oh yeah, not kins infected. I should probably deal with that at some point. Why am I hearing this noise? Oh, oh, my immunity is going down. Is that because I'm in an affected area? Yes, it is. Yep. That's uh, my fault for letting Notkin get infected, isn't it? Right, I'll go brew some immunity things, uh, <laughs> and then I'll take some medicines to some people. Oh, that's plague there. run through it. Let's just run through it. We'll get out if we just run through it. Please let me out. <laughs> Please don't be plague here either. Oh Jesus Christ. Oh, I see plague down there. And there's my bull. For some reason I bought a bull. Hello, fellows. What you doing out here? For you, heart liver kidneys, they still smell of life. 
You've killed someone and cut them open. Is that so? Make potions as your father. Cures from grief, poison, envy, aches. He made any cure when he had good meat. This is good meat. Take it. Only a menku can cut a body as there are menku above me. No, we have broken the law. Those who do not know the lions cannot cut the bodies. We will give our lives. Why? You do need these real potions of meat. Herbs have borders. Your great father used more than herbs. He made cures from blood and flesh from those alive. What kind of cures? Any kind. Cures for pain, cures for fever, cures for Cures for the inner fiver. Fire. Uh, fire. Uh. Speeches. <laughs> it's slowing down now. Cures for all layers of the body. Those who know the lines can cure any disease with guts and herbs. This is how the world works. So it's a universal method. These people seem to know more than I do, and they are very cute. I do like the worms. These are a gift, so you don't risk your life. Don't cut the living unless there is a need. Don't cut the dead unless there is a need. Even if you're a good Menku. Bodos does not like it. Better we suffer than you. I accept your gift and your sacrifice. Okay, so I've dropped some stuff because I'm running out of space. Let's uh, do some organization, lads. I'm not clearing out the right kind of space here. Uh, hopefully these things will be here if I go stick my stuff indoors and then come back and then loot from them again. I don't know, we'll, we'll live to find out. We'll live to find out together. <laughs> And uh, that immunity is looking quite low. many things here that I just I do not know if I'm going to need them it just it felt sensible to take them <laughs> Enough blabbering. all right sorry kid now I don't know if I'm supposed to keep this pass on me to be honest so I can use that to sharpen tools that's good to know Okay, I'm, I must have cleaned out enough space to go grab those other things from the worms. And I would like the worms things. Yes, let me loot from you. 
Excellent. Au revoir, gang. <laughs> Let me back into the safe building. <laughs> I desire to brew some stuff. <laughs> and I can also see what I need to fix things too. So, yep, still don't know what that other object is. <sighs> yep, there's still an object there that I do not know what it is. I still don't have a safety pin. Oh, can I fix things myself now? That's what this is telling me. Okay. Let's, uh, oh, I didn't want to do that. Stick the body parts in here. And I guess they will become useful at some point in time. So I've got two things for sharpening tools. Useful to repair delicate equipment. Fine, I'll stick those with these things. Yeah, I'm uh, not sure what I would need matches for. Uh, I guess I'll find out eventually. <laughs> Oh yeah, this must be such exciting gameplay for everyone. Um. Stick that up there and out the way. Nice that my immunity goes up while I'm in here. So, there's someone that's still selling a revolver on there. I thought they were only going to wait two days. Let's mix up some stuff. So we've got a few different tinctures. So I'm going to try and keep those all in one space over here. needle in the cabinet too. Cool. I think that's it for me now. This has been kind of stressful, I'm not gonna lie. Wait, can I... Ah, oh, I can get water here. Nice. Good to know. How exhausted am I first? I might take a little nap. Oh. And I won't have to do that when I first start playing again. Oh. 
Day four, in which the theatre observes a full house. making it sound like a very bad thing. Right, well, oh, it looks like I've got a lot of stuff to do today, and I'm very hungry. Let's, um... Eat an egg and maybe some hazelnuts. No, we'll just eat the egg. <laughs> we'll suffer when we start up again, eh, gang? Right, well, it's been fun. I hope you've enjoyed my suffering. I am so scared to get back on with this game now that there's so many more infected districts. But I'm going to make it through. Uh, thank you for joining me. Hope to see you in the next one.